Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am TK Beauty and in today's video, we got a haul and it's the Sephora haul. You guys know I do these videos on my channel every year. As a matter of fact, my very first video was a Sephora haul. I love doing these videos. I love when this time of year comes because I get a chance to pick up goodies that I've been eyeing throughout the year. So I got a couple of goodies. I got a little bit of everything. <laughs> I feel like I got more makeup this time than I did anything else. There were some products, two in particular, that I did have to return, so then I just ended up getting some other things and I will let you guys know what those products were and what I got in, in exchange for those products. But before we jump into this haul, if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, go ahead guys, if you like the content, if you like what you see here, then go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Click that notification bell also so that you'll know every time I upload a new video. So let's just jump right on into this haul. <laughs> so I'm not gonna go in any particular order. And before I get started, so I've already used some of my products on my face that I picked up during the sale. But the makeup tutorial for that will be coming the following week after this video comes up. So if you're interested in how I did this makeup look, then that video, then that makeup tutorial will be coming soon. I'm not gonna go in any particular order, so I'm just gonna reach in and pick out stuff. So the first thing that I had to repurchase is the Necessaire Body Wash and Eucalyptus. Y'all, I did not think I was going to love this body wash as much as I have, but I love this. I absolutely love this body wash and I feel like it's definitely worth the money. It smells so good, it's so nice, so refreshing. It just, it, you just feel clean and nourished when you get through using this body wash. So I had to repurchase this. Now I did have a gift card that I used. I got a gift card for my birthday. And so I used my gift card to get two eyebrow pencils. You guys know these are my holy grail eyebrow pencils. I love the precisely my brow pencil. I got them in the shade number six. I don't think it's gonna focus, but I got them in the shade number six, which is a cool soft black. It is the pencil that I used um, for my brows today, and this is just, this pencil has just never done me wrong. I stick with it, so got two of these. The next product that I got, it is a new concealer. I have been hearing nothing but great things about this concealer. This is the Kossas Super Creamy Plus Brightening Concealer and I got it in the shade 7.5. I got it in the shade 7.5. I've heard nothing but great things about this concealer. And this is the packaging on that. And I thought this would be a really nice shade for me. Not too dark not too light so i did use this underneath my eyes today so far so good i do need, still need to kind of wear this just to see if i'm really loving it but so far not too bad okay the next item i got i actually ended up picking this up because i, I returned the nars highway cheek palette i did not like that i didn't love it at all um so i was not going to keep that in my collection so in exchange for that i have been wanting to try this for a while but this product has been sold out and that's the anastasia beverly hills brow freeze this is a brow styling wax and that's the packaging there and i did use this today but this is again the packaging of that the product is just a clear gel and so far y'all i really do like this product it really just allows my brows to kind of stay in place okay and then in exchange for that same nars palette i ended up getting a perfume i got the atler cologne this is the vanilla In incense i don't know i may be butchering that but this is it I wanted another perfume that had vanilla in it. I had to return the Ness Madagascar Vanilla Perfume Oil. I just wasn't in love with that one as much as I thought I was going to be. So I, I just had to get that out of my collection. But I still wanted to get another vanilla scented perfume. And I saw this one in there when I returned that NARS palette. So I was like, well, let me give this a try. So I only got the travel size. And y'all, from what I sprayed, I'm not gonna lie, this kind of puts me in the mind. It's a nice smell, but it does 
a little bit put me in the mind of the um, Killian Love Don't Be Shy just with the undertone because it has that kind of that fruity cereal undertone to me but it's a little bit softer it's a little bit lighter but I do like this especially once it dries down I know I'm gonna have to play around with this one spray it and wear it out some more but so far it's not too bad I just wanted to try this out I've never heard of anybody really talking about this brand or this particular scent so I am glad that I picked it up to just try it out to see if I like it another product that I got it is the makeup by Mario a glam quad and this is in bronzy glam now I am wearing this on my eyes today and I absolutely love it I wanted to get this because these were on sale so this had been marked down to $15 and then you get the 20% off so this is the packaging on that just simple black and white packaging and this is how those colors look I really do like this eyeshadow palette you can't beat this I'm glad I picked this up another product that I got in place of the NARS palette it's this Sephora Micro Smooth Multitasking Baked Face Palette. And this is in Captivate. So this is the darkest palette that they have. But y'all, this is absolutely gorgeous. This is so beautiful. I'm so glad that I, I picked this up. I'm glad that I ended up taking back that NARS palette and I got this because this is so nice. This is so pretty, y'all. And so pigmented. Now, this is also a product that I am currently wearing on my face. I have the highlighter, the blush, and even the, the bronzer on today. And I just think this is just so beautiful. It's so subtle. You can build it up, but it's really subtle. I like that. And it's still pigmented. Like the blushes in here are pigmented. So with this palette, you get one highlighter, you get uh, two blushes and then you get like a bronzer shade here and it's just really really nice and you guys know the Sephora collection is 30% off or not is it was 30% off and I'm just glad I got my hands on this because this is really really nice another product that I picked up is the Dior backstage face and body powder no powder now I've heard quite a few people talking about this powder um, in particular I heard Andrea Renee talking about this and I was just curious about it so I decided to go ahead and bite the bullet and give it a try I got mine in 6N and um, I did use it today I'm gonna have to use this some more just to see how I like it but this is the packaging of it and this is the actual product here so I'm glad I picked it up during the sale so I will keep you guys posted on how I'm liking that so I picked up another body product this is the Josie Marion whipped argon oil body butter and I got it in vanilla bean now you guys know I love the Fenty Beauty whipped butter but I wanted to try something else and I wanted to try this out I think it was either this year or last year around the sale time and they were sold out of the vanilla bean one so I decided to go ahead and pick it up this year that's the packaging there and let's open her and smell her and see what she's smelling like I'm hoping that I love this one too otherwise this is going back to the store as well <laughs> it has a nice light scent I don't know if it's vanilla though that's how the product looks and it smells good so I can't wait to use my body oil with this one just to see how it's going to smell but I'm glad I picked this up. Okay, another product that I got from the Sephora collection, I have want, I've been wanting to try an eye cream, so I picked up an eye cream. I picked up the Sephora Brightening Eye Cream, and I guess this is supposed to hydrate and to be puff. And again, Sephora had their, their collection was 30% off, and I decided to get me an eye cream I haven't used it yet so I will definitely keep you guys posted on this I have one more perfume that I picked up this is a repurchase this is by Nest this is the sun-kissed hibiscus perfume and y'all this smells really good I got another travel size perfume from them but I absolutely love this perfume this is one of my favorites by Nest and the other favorite perfume that I have by Nest is the Indian Jasmine perfume oil. I mean, these have just been a game changer for me. I love this one. 
oh it just smells really really good really nice now this is more of a spring and summer scent but i think i'm going to just try to mix it maybe with the perfume that i have now the vanilla incense one that i picked up during the sale i'm going to try to mix these two and just see what it smells like because you can layer this one so we'll see i'm just gonna play around with my perfumes okay guys i picked up a couple more eyeshadow palettes ridiculous i just absolutely ridiculous i ended up picking up now this one i didn't go in there for i just happened to be in that owl because i was going to get another lip liner from huda beauty and then i saw this i saw the wild chamulon palette look at that y'all look at the packaging let me take it out the box but look at the packaging on here it's absolutely gorgeous this called my name and i'm gonna tell you what colors got me this gold right here this purple right here and then this color right here this whole palette is absolutely gorgeous i cannot wait to use this it had a beauty gap and then the last eyeshadow palette that i got is from natasha denona i did go ahead and pick up the retro palette now this is more of a cool tone palette i'm not really into cool tone palettes like this but i have been kind of gravitating to them more lately i love the color of this packaging absolutely stunning love this color here are the actual shades here absolutely gorgeous cannot wait to play in this eyeshadow palette okay we got a couple more products guys um most of these are lippies and point perks the next item that i got it's the sephora lip sleeping mask i thought this would be really cool to try out i saw that they had this and i was like let me try that out and this is supposed to be in vanilla i can tell you guys right now this does not smell like vanilla i don't know what this smells like but it ain't vanilla but i only used this once i need to use this again just to see how i like it i'm glad i picked this up this was really inexpensive five dollars plus 30 percent off so couldn't beat that so i'm glad i picked that up i ended up getting a lippy from the makeup by mario collection i saw this lippy on a black woman on instagram and i fell in love with it i was like i need to have that lippy it looks so good on her so i picked up the lipstick in sierra this is the packaging very sleek i I do feel like the packaging is just a little bit bulky oh, this lipstick is so pretty and I love the fact that he has um, now I did use this today so that's why it's a little used but he does have his um, his name on the lipstick you guys probably can't see that he has his name on the lipstick which I think is a nice touch on the lipsticks this is such a pretty color it's light but if you use a nice liner with it it's going to be so so pretty love this you can pair it with any lip gloss that you have so i'm definitely glad that i picked this up and the next lippy i got i've been wanting to try this for a while um this is by charlotte tilbury this is the pillow talk matte revolution i got this in pillow talk medium and i thought this color was so pretty but i cannot wait to try this out this is the this is the packaging on that super super pretty and it has a nice candy type of scent to it, it smells like candy but y'all look at this lipstick i love just like the indentions of this lipstick y'all see that so pretty love the detail of this lipstick i cannot wait to wear this i'm glad i got my hands on that and then the last lip product that i picked up is from the sephora collection it's their lip last matte lipstick in the shade sienna and i just thought this would be a pretty just an everyday brownie type of shade so pretty so i'm definitely glad i got my hands on this one and then the last product that i got it is by clinique i've heard some good things about this so i was like let me just go ahead and try it it's their clinique take the day off cleansing balm and this was a point perk so that's why i got it i'm waiting on them to send me my other point perk because it wasn't in my box from the things that i ordered so they said they were going to put it in the mail for me but it's just a clinique mascara that i really like so this is the clinique take the day off cleansing balm i love this purple packaging yeah i love this purple packaging 
and then that's the cleansing balm so I can't wait I'll probably use this today to take this stuff off that's everything that I picked up doing this for VIB yeah. okay guys so that is the end of this video I hope that you guys enjoyed the Sephora VIB haul that I did comment down below and let me know some of the goodies that you picked up doing this sale that you are really really loving I would love to know and also comment if you got some of the same things that I picked up don't forget guys to subscribe to my channel click that notification bell so that you'll know every time I upload a new video and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys Thank you.